Hi everybody! So today's Halloween hair tutorial is a dead prom queen look. So if you would like to learn, keep watching. Okay, so we're going to start off with day old hair. Harjeet had um, lightly curled her hair yesterday and I like the texture. So I'm not going to do too much to it except for back combing. So let's start off with Orbe Dry Texturizing Spray. You guys know that this is one of our favorite teasing sprays to use. So let's do it in sections. I'm gonna start at the top, and you can spray it from the roots all the way to the mids. I'm going to be teasing it quite a bit, so stay at the front as well. Just go in there. as well. So I sprayed it all in all around. So I'm just going to massage it in. Okay, let that dry texturizing spray absorb into her hair. And you can already see like that texture that she has going on right now. But I'm going to tease it just so that um, it creates a base so that all the pins can anchor into her hair properly. So let's just go go to town with the teasing. Tease it all over. I'm gonna tease her fringe. It's getting there. <laughs> so I'm gonna get go through the top. Same sectioning, so horizontal across the head. And you don't want it to be too wide in width because then you won't be teasing all of the hair, you'll only be teasing the back section. So you can see it's probably about half an inch in width. Hold it really tight, take your comb, and just comb down. And if the hair is sitting like this on its own, then you're doing it right. Alright, so I finished the front and the sides, and I've done most of the back, but I just wanted to show you how I do the back. So still taking the same sectioning as I do around the sides, vertical sections. And once again, remember this is for padding in the back. This is going to help anchor all the pins and keep your hair up all night. So it doesn't have to be a perfect teasing. I'm just going to use my mason, just lightly brush the back coming out through the top and the sides. This just kind of blends the lines, blends the teasing so you don't have those line of demarcation of where your um, teasing section is. Okay, so I like the amount of volume she has going on. So now we're gonna pin the back and uh, create the shape. Uh, my inspiration is just going to be kind of like a messy French twist um, slash French twist slash um, updo. <laughs> I'm just going to take hair and gather it and then just start pinning it. So you can see I'm just gathering some hair, pulling it over, and I'm going to take a hair pin and then pin it in place. So because of all that teasing, the hair, the hair will stay in place. The pins will stay in place, I mean. Let's take it. Okay. So that's one. I'm going to take another section. Bring it on over to the opposite side. 
pin that. Pin that into place. And you just keep repeating it on both sides. So the last little bit, I'm just going to take it, tuck it under. And I'm really just like taking the hair, squishing it together and then just pinning it. This is kind of popping out. The piece underneath is kind of falling out, so I'm going to re-tuck it into place. Okay. And don't be afraid to reinforce it with more pins. Okay. And I'm just going to pull out some pieces, make it a little more messy. She is dead after all. <laughs> Just for one day. Yes. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna pull the fringe out. And this is the fun part. Just mess it up. I know we just like worked on pinning all this up, but... Okay, I'm going to round brush her fringe because I feel like it's a little too curly, so I'm just gonna smooth it out. So for the final touch, the prom queen's crown. So I think that it would look better if it was kind of like messy and lopsided, not perfect. Mm -hmm. So we're just gonna put it in, kind of crooked. Actually, I'm gonna pull some of her bangs upwards because I'm gonna pull it through the crown. So I'm going to use some dry texturizing spray just to kind of go over the ends and add a little bit of texture, spray it in. So that was really I easy like to do. it. So we're going to um, do Harji's makeup, and we'll get back to you after we're all done. Thank you. Bye. And here is the final look with the makeup. Um, please do not judge our makeup skills. We are hairdressers, not makeup artists, but we thought we'd try our best. So we hope you enjoy this tutorial. Give it a try, and happy Halloween, everybody! Thank you.